Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. All right, so in today's video, we are doing a back to school, first day of school. You wanna look your best. You had your eight hours of sleep. You had, you know, you are just well rested, whatever you wanna call it, makeup look. All right, so we're doing a first day of school, back to school makeup look. This is the look we're going for. A nice, simple, but yet snatched and put together look. And if you want to know how to get this look, sit tight, don't go anywhere, we're getting started. Take my First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream, and this one is in the pink grapefruit like scented flavor. So that is what I'm taking with me. And this is a nice big tub. So you know it does not disappear quickly which I love about. So we're gonna rub that in all over our face. So because this is a back to school, going to school type of makeup, I'm gonna safely assume you guys don't have a lot of time to put on makeup. Maybe you wanna sleep in more. Maybe you woke up late cause you know, you're not used to waking up early anymore. Who knows, maybe you're going from middle school to high school. So you're, you know, waking up time has changed. I don't know. So we're going to pretend that your makeup time is, you don't have that much time. You're in a pinch. So we want to put on some nice, you know, not glamorous, but still you want to look freshened up. You want to look awake. So with that said, we're going to kind of like do this makeup look in a way where we can speed things up, but still look like we, you know, put a little bit of effort into it. You get what I'm saying? So after your lotion, what I'm gonna do is do my brows real quick and you know, let the lotion set a little bit. So for my brows, instead of using like a brow pencil, which is a really good idea for this video, I'm gonna take my e.l.f. Uh, matte for matte eyeshadow palette. And if you open it up, they have beautiful matte shades in there. Taking this brush right here, it's just like a flat brush. And taking that dark shade right over here, that dark brown shade, we're going to quickly fill in the brows. Just kind of filling in the sparse, empty spaces. You know what, as a matter of fact, I'm gonna mix in that matte black in there as well. Now, it really works if you have like a good amount of brow hair. So if you don't really have a nice amount of brow hair, you might want to pick up the brow pencil. And a really good one that I recommend is the one by e.l.f. They definitely make some nice, affordable brow pencils. He Hills Tinted Brow Gel. And just quickly run that through. Have our face lotion all nice and settled in it's time for a face primer and a good, good way to quickly do your face primer is to get one of those primer mist like a spray instead of like the lotion kind and a really nice great one is the elf aqua primer mist so all you have to do is just kind of sit back a little bit and foundation and a really nice foundation that you can use is by it cosmetics and after giving this foundation like a second chance, I actually like it. It did really well. I tried it on for a barbecue I went to a couple, not too long ago. And A, I got a ton of compliments about it. And B, I mean, it has SPF and anti-aging and hydrating serum. I mean, you really can't beat that. So grab whatever foundation you want to use. So I'm going to use this foundation. And... Place that on your face, and then you can use like a um, like a sponge, maybe even like this little sponge right here, or use a brush, whatever you want to use to you know put your foundation on. I'm gonna start off by using this brush right here, and just. And with my. Morphe brush, we're going to just blend 
all that out. Products, I can go ahead and do my powder products. So I'm going to go ahead and set my foundation. You know what? I messed up. Backtrack. We're not done yet. We got concealer to do. How can I forget that? First thing is... First day of school and you don't want to miss concealer because you want to look like you are well rested, you got your 8 hours of sleep, you are awake, ready to learn, you know, all that good stuff. So, a good concealer for that. So, with all that said, a good concealer for that, again, another e.l.f. product. It would be the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer. You guys, this is a great concealer. It does dry up rather quickly, so number one, you have to work pretty fast. And number two, definitely do like a swatch test. Or, I mean, you can buy a couple of them because they don't really, they aren't really too expensive. But the names of it doesn't really go with the shade that comes out, if I don't say so myself. Just my humble opinion. So let's conceal our face. Look at that just right under my eyes. Look how much brighter that looks. That is, concealer is like magic. Yeah, you definitely wanna put concealer on. So let's do the other eye. And if you guys notice, I'm doing one eye at a time. Sometimes I just do like two eyes, like zoop, zoop, and then go in with my brush. But this time, one eye at a time. Going with our powder, and today I'm gonna use the Airspun Loose Face Powder. This is definitely affordable and works well, does the job. So I'm just gonna tap my little sponge into the powder and then We're not doing like crazy baking, but just a little bit. I mean, you want your makeup to last. So just a little bit of baking. That's it for like a couple of minutes, not too long. And then just take a nice fluffy brush and dust all that away contour our face and the contour i'm using is the butter bronzer and this one is deep bronzer we all know what the butter bronzer is it's like everyone loves it and i feel like almost everyone loves the smell of it but i'm probably the odd one out and i don't like the smell of this butter bronzer but the makeup itself works amazing so i'm using this brush right here this little funny brush and we're going to kind of Go in brush right here. We're just going to blend all that bronzer out. And remember, when you're working on your chin, you want to move downwards on your cheeks, move upwards. On your temple, move back. Taking the Milani Romantic Rose in 01, and this is a nice, like, mauve blush color, a perfect back to school blush color. So take some of that and then place that on your cheeks and even go over your nose. I feel like it gives it like a nice, young, youthful glow. I mean, for you guys, probably you don't have to do that because I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys are much younger than me. So, but, I mean, do it anyway, actually. Who doesn't want to look young forever, right? So do that with your blush. And now for the highlighter, we're taking... This highlighter right here by Wet n Wild. This is the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Bar. And this one's in the shade Air. And 
that is what it looks like. much we're done with the face so we're gonna go in with the eyes and we're going back in with the elf mad for matte eyeshadow palette and we're gonna use some of these beautiful shades and colors to do our eye look this very top shade right here and we're gonna place that all over our lid And then taking a much fluffier brush, I'm going to take this shade right here and place that pretty much like a windshield, windshield wiper all over. My you guys, I do apologize. My camera just cut off, but I wasn't doing much. I was just putting on some glitter using my Urban Decay. Starfire right on the inner corners. Bit you guys, and that's gonna really amp up your look and give it that nice finish to your back to school, first day of school, whatever you want to call it, makeup look. All right. so here is the final look and of course for me you guys if you want to put your hair down put your hair up go ahead but normally when I was in school my hair was up pretty much every day because I want to get it out of my face and just you know be ready to study and learn all right so got my hair pulled back and yeah that's it you guys so here is the final look it is a nice rather simple back to school first day of school makeup look. Hey, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this look and this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification bell for future giveaways. All right? So that is it. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, a wonderful night, wherever you are. I will talk to you next time. All right? Bye.